Good morning. We just morning. ate some breakfast and we're going to go down and get to our shuttle at 7 o'clock. Um, and then we'll be on the trail for only seven miles today. Actually, I think less than that. Kara's drinking coffee. Mm. <laughs> we're back on trail this morning and the sunrise is so beautiful. I'm protecting my face from the wind. It's a little chilly. It's not as cold as it was when we went up Blood Mountain, but and it's not even as windy as it was then, but it's a little chilly. So this morning I decided not to listen to music or a book or a podcast because I wanted to hear some of the sounds of nature today and I heard a lot of birds this morning. I know you can hear that one out there and the wind and the leaves and it's been nice. And it also like kind of helps you think about some things and man it's so far down there. Jeez. Better not fall off here. But it also helps you think about some things. And last night I was very, very anxious because I knew we were going to have a trail today. So uh, I definitely took a sleeping pill because, not a sleeping pill, I just took a Tylenol PM, but because I knew my brain was not going to shut off last night because we were worried about the storms and the, and the shelter that we were going to stay at the day of the storm only has seven spots and so yeah I was a little bit anxious last night but right now I'm feeling thankful that I'm back out on the trail because I'm just so happy I'm here. Like I love that it's so beautiful. We're hanging out on this cool rock. We're gonna make it to camp so early today but that's okay. That's a good time to relax. But look how far down that goes. We were talking earlier about how in town we're like all stressed out about like all the things, anything you can think of. Money, time, how many miles we're doing. And then you get back out here after not being, or after being in town and you're like, oh, why am I so worried about that stuff? But it's been really nice to be back today. I'm very happy. Are you happy, Ryan? Yeah. Good. It's a little cold. Yeah, it's a little windy and cold today, but it's, it's about to warm up for sure. Uh, I've been keeping this covering my face because the wind's pretty bad but once you get behind the mountain like we're kind of behind the mountain like where the wind's not blowing and so it's it's nice over here all right guys I think I've accepted a trail name I'm gonna be sniffles from now on so as I sniffle <laughs> um, I introduced myself as sniffles a minute ago because you know what, it could be worse than sniffles, and it's kind of ironic. It's finally warm outside. Um, so the little spot that we're on on the HE right now is, it used to be a wagon road. So you can kind of tell, I'll show you in a minute. Um, but we're between Low Gap Shelter and Pop Bar Gap, I believe. It could be a shelter, I can't remember right now. I'm sorry, I'm so bad at remembering this stuff. Because it's like, there's thousands of things to remember and it's names are not the easiest thing for me to remember, but that's all right, I'll get better at it. But um, this little spot used to be a wagon road, I'll show you. You can see how wide it is. We're kind of like over here, it's like, very wide but like the rest of the trail has been very small so it's 
pretty interesting. I wish I knew more history about it, honestly. Camp set up. Kara's on the today. phone again. Nuh uh. <laughs> on the phone? <laughs> Stay away from that. Ooh. So, I've had questions about who everybody is and what our relationships are. And so, Kara, this beautiful, lovely lady here, is Ryan's aunt. And I am Ryan's girlfriend, so that's it. My name's not Ryan. Um, Stash Squatch. Oops. I cannot get used to saying that. Sorry. I'm going by myself to find this water. It's supposedly like 0.3 away from the trail. I mean, away from the campsite. So let's see if we can find it. Today's video is probably going to be short and maybe a little boring, but... That's okay. Check it out guys, I packed a beer out. Look, there's a little hiking turtle on it. It's so cute. I packed uh, two beers out. Two beers. Two beers. Um, this is Terrapin Beer Company, Athens, Georgia. And it's called the Hopsecutioner. It's all right, it's warm, so I can't yeah. really give a good review of it, but it's a beer. Mm. It's funny because I don't even like IPAs and I'm drinking this warm, but it's actually not that bad. It's really, it's not that bad. This one's like really good. I drank one cold yesterday, so it was fine. Colder, and you air. 